Okay, here I have a flow screen, and you can see I've got the input rich text FSC extension, which I've installed into this org. It's installable via package. Uh, and I am going to take the output from that. And here I have a standard display text, and I am simply uh, using the automatic output from the previous, uh, from that input rich text and you can go and just click on value and that's what I've done here and I got it twice here so let's run this and so here's what the rich text input looks like you can do uh, you can do some set some attributes on this to do things like turn off this this footer uh, so you have some control but what we're gonna do let's just to create something in the clipboard Let's just go and, I don't know, grab this little thing here. And so now I have that in the clipboard. So I'm going to simply paste it into here. And so this is the pasted from clipboard. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to also upload from file system and simply click on this, this toolbar item here and grab something from the file system and there's that uh, and so on the next screen it's going to take the output from this and display it and there it is so basically all of this these images successfully are being passed out of that rich text input in the form of a rich text data uh, stream basically and uh, can be can be played can be displayed later on in the flow now how do you get those images out of the flow well there's a couple different ways you can do it uh, I'll show you a couple of the most straightforward one of the things you can do is save an image that you pasted from the clipboard into the a rich text field on an object so in this case uh, I'm creating an account and I created a custom field on the account object of type rich text and so I'm basically just grabbing that from the output of just like I grabbed the output from uh, the original rich text control to show it here I'm grabbing that same output right here. You'll notice here it looks different. This is one of the first places where we have implemented these friendly pills. But if we double click on this, you'll see that it is the same underlying uh, field reference. So uh, let's change this to test two and save it and run it. And let's paste in uh, that from the clipboard and we're done and let's go look now and go take a look at the accounts And here's the newly created test two. And if we look at the fields and scroll down here, you can see that it's basically the same interface and the same data. So you can read data from rich text fields, uh, display it and edit it in a flow screen using the rich text input extension uh, and save back to rich text fields. Another thing you can do is send this in an email. For that, take a look at Send Better Email, uh, which fully supports rich text as in the body of email messages.